On the twelfth day of Christmas, my sweet self gave to me something lovely from the party at LV. <laughs> That's for you, Sandy. Party time! <laughs> I was super excited to get the invitation to the Louis Vuitton Christmas party. I have a wonderful CA who is kind enough uh, to get me on the list each year. I'm always happy, always excited to be a part of it, and I do love it. When she sent the invitation over to me, I just read quickly uh, the note that she had put under the invitation. It comes out electronically to me. And I didn't look at the actual invite. So I spent the entire prepping time thinking that the party was actually tonight when it was last night. I happened to pick it up and take a look at it. I was speaking to a friend going, hey, um, I've got to do some prep for the party. And I went to go take a look at it and realized that it was last night and it was later in the day and I had to kind of rush to get over there. I felt like that was a really good thing though because I usually panic just a little bit about what I'm going to wear. Oh, what shoes? Do I need to buy a new shirt? Uh, that kind of thing. And that didn't happen at all. I didn't even have time to worry about it. I just went, oh, snap, I got to I gotta get there. And that's exactly what happened. I had to make everything happen real quickly. My hubs uh, ended up being off of work. Um, so he's been working tons and tons of hours and I kind of wanted him to go, but he kind of wanted to sleep. I can so appreciate that. So I ended up uh, heading over there on my own because I just needed to go so quickly. All right, so here we go. The bag that I wore to the party was none other than my Brittany, and she did so incredibly well. She held her own amongst all the other bags that were there, and the lipstick that I wore, I've got to pull it out. I had the uh, mini pochette special edition. The lipstick that I wore was Revolutionary, I think. Yep, Revolutionary. This is the Color the World. Love these lipsticks. I have been wearing them for a couple of days now. I know you guys have seen the, the video on them. I really, the creamy feeling is so good. The one that I've got on tonight is Coco Raz. It ended up being a little too dark, so I put independent on top of it to give it a little bit of a blend. So that one might end up being a little bit too dark for me because um, I'm kind of pale. I know that's surprising to you. Uh, but anyway, I wore this bag. I really loved it. It was kind of uh, cute, actually. There was a newer employee. They're all so friendly there, and I love chatting with each one of them. But he saw my bag, and he goes, oh, the Brittany. He goes, my mom loves that bag. And I'm like, what? <laughs> wants to hear my mom loves. I felt a little old and he was very young, um, which was kind of funny. But I, and I was like, there's still Britney's in the, in the, it's on, you can buy them from the store. What are you talking about? <laughs> he was such a sweetheart. The team that is at my local Vuitton boutique is absolutely incredible. I don't know that there's anyone there I would consider salty or saucy. They're very friendly. They take time to chat with you, to make sure that you're taken care of. Any one of them are happy to go get you some liquid while you're there. And the party was no exception. Uh, there were hugs all around, and who doesn't want some hugs? So that you know, they had that going on. They had a a photographer that had one like a machine where you could and, and like a like a like a Louis Vuitton backdrop, 
and you could stand there and they would take your picture. They were printing them out and then sending them via email. I ended up, I did that and I was like, oh, I don't really like, because it's just a generic camera in this machine and it's and the and people kept taking their pictures over and over throughout the party because they would look at it and be like mm, and they <laughs> they would go stand with their friend again so they kept going back and forth fortunately i had where's it at i had my oh here it is i had this which is um my vlogging camera uh, not camera but my vlogging tripod that i take if i'm going to go somewhere i, I had this with me and i just put my phone on it and did the, you know, and I think that it turned out better than pretty much most of what I was seeing. So I was really grateful that I was able just to sneak it in and go, ting, real quickly. Uh, so that ended up being really good. The individual, they had a playing, they had a saxophonist. And this gentleman has been here there for like the past, I think, three years. Really incredible, very smooth player. I'm I'm always so impressed by him. I wanted to go and have a, a chat with him, but you know he was on it, like you know, not really taking a break much because it was earlier in the party, and I only stayed an hour. The party was, I think, a couple hours long. I only stayed an hour. Um, I did get there right on time, maybe even a couple of minutes early, and here's why. I was really worried that I wasn't going to be able to get the holiday bag. Now, you guys know that holiday bag is really beautiful, and I was sweating it because there's some hunger for the bag. <laughs> there's people are hungry for it. They're hungry for the bag. That's me too. I was so hungry for the bag. So I got there early and spoke to my CA. So excited to see her. I hadn't seen her in a couple of months. So pleasant. Love our chats. Uh, I'm just so grateful uh, to have to have an individual that is so knowledgeable, so pleasant, so professional. I can't say enough about the individuals that are there. If this person were not there, if they were on vacation, there are three others that I could immediately uh, look at and have good conversations and they would be just as knowledgeable. No complaints at all. Here we go. Let's pop this bag open, shall we? Did I, did I get the holiday bag or did I not get the holiday bag? What do you guys think? Did I, did I not get it or did I get it? <laughs> I got it. Look at that. Is that not a beautiful bag? This is honestly one of the most beautiful bags I have seen them do. I feel like that. I, I, I am so smitten by this bag. It's a shame to be smitten that much by a piece of a piece of papery bag, but friends and neighbors, I really am. I'm a, I'm a smitten woman over this bag. Maybe I could just carry all my stuff in this. I could laminate it and just walk around in it because I feel like I love it that much. I'm really excited that I was able to get one. And I'm glad that I went early to the party and my plan worked. So here we go. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, wait. I got to get a hold of it a different way. Na, 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 na. Oh, there's the box. Let me look in the bottom. Uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> uh, so, oh y'all, I can't even show you this picture because it's so horrible. Like, I'm going to flash it. Whew. That's the picture. Okay. Okay, got the receipt. I thought, they usually have a chocolate bar, and I thought the lady said, I put your chocolate bar in the bag, but I don't see it. And that's okay because I shouldn't be eating the chocolate bar, so that's fine. So this is what the box looks like. I love that I got the little tag. Woo! Here's, here's, so here's the box. I love that I got the little tag. Real excited about that. All right, let's get, let's dig into it. I'm going to try my best to be a good unboxer. You guys know this is not my strong suit here. <laughs> mm -hmm. There we go. Are you ready? Dun, bum, bum, bum. Da, 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 da. Oh, what is it? Do you think you know what it is? What do you think it might be? I don't know. Just get to the unboxing. Okay. Mm -hmm. So let's pull it out. Okay. There we go. 
Oh, that sounded kind of rough. All right, so here we go. I'm gonna lift this up. Any ideas yet? Hmm? Dun, 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 dun. Wah, 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 wah. <laughs> okay, here we go, I can't. Here we go, here we go. Ta-da! It is the Sienna. Now, you guys have probably heard me chatting about the Sienna for a little bit. Let me tell you, I have been wanting the Sienna PM for quite a while. I get down to that party, and don't you know, I walk away with a Sienna MM. I didn't expect that. Didn't see it coming. I was struggling between getting the Sienna. I was thinking about getting the Neverfull Damier Azure and the... Um, Let's see what else was on my mind down there. I can't remember the name of the bag. I'll 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 across the top. <laughs> I'll tell you what it is. The name is escaping me at the moment, and I'm so sorry about that. Uh, but it was uh, between like three bags. I couldn't make a decision. I the moment she pulled the MM out, it was over for me. She did show me the PM. I asked for. I had asked for uh, just a look-see at the Sienna, and in my I didn't specify, and I'm glad that I didn't. I In my head, it was the a PM, and she threw on the counter the MM first, and I went, oh, it's perfect, and I go, this is the PM, and she's like, no, it's the MM, and she got the PM out and showed me. I do believe the PM would have been just a little bit small. I could have made it happen, but frankly, if I want a small bag, I can use the favorite. I do have some smaller bags. Uh, the thing that I'm so excited about this particular bag is I feel like everyone has been comparing it to, uh, you know, like, oh, it's uh, different from the Speedy. It's better than the Speedy because the profile is better. It looks better against you. Um, I was super excited because sometimes when you're using the Speedy, the sides can be a hindrance, or, or they are to me. I don't know if they are to everybody, but they are to me. Not that I don't love this Speedy. Super excited to have, uh, you know, them. I've got more than one over there. Really excited about it. But I am excited because this one, it feels like it's a little bit bigger uh, in the opening itself. I just dig this so very much. So, and you guys have, I don't want to go too much into it. You guys have seen this bag debuted over and over and over. You, I will just say like, look, there's a good pocket back there. There's a couple of pockets up front here. I dig that. Uh, more often than not, you know, the bags that they that we have, like the Neverfull doesn't have any pockets in it. So there is a strap down here so you can connect it to do the long uh, carry or even possibly a, um, I haven't tried it crossbody, so I honestly don't know, but I could strap anything to the sides and make it crossbody if this doesn't work. I'm really over the moon. This has been a long time coming. I have waited, oh gosh, I mean two, at least two years I have been debating this bag. And there, yes, there were, um, a, the, the bag that I was looking at was, what is the name of that bag? Um, it's newer. And I was really interested in, in that, but I, I saw this and went, you know, this has been out for a while. And what if, what if 2020 is a dry Louis Vuitton year and I don't purchase anything and this goes off the market? I would pass out because I've wanted this bag for at least two years. So that's why I said, you know what, let's just, let's just go with the Sienna and make that happen. I also want to show you my little toy here, as my hubs calls it. It's my favorite thing that he says about uh, Louis Vuitton uh, when he calls it a toy. It makes me happy because, you know, you can bat it and play with it. So, I mean, I don't disagree at all. So, is that beautiful? I love it. I love, um, can you see that? Oh, it's just so pretty. I love it. I love everything about it. Super giddy. 
I will, of course, be back to share more with you about um, what I think about it. I'll compare it to a couple of other bags that I'm very interested in, not necessarily the Speedy, but honestly, I, I actually want to pit it against the Brittany. Uh, there was a lovely young gentleman who was, uh, I, I don't know him very well. He's another, um, another CA that's there at Vuitton, fairly new. And we kept having such wonderful little conversations throughout the evening. And I kept looking at the counter. The only thing that was um, making me wonder a little bit about my purchase was I was worried that it would be too similar and it was kind of funny because he was like, no, because this you would use this for this and you would use this for that. And he really made me feel good about the purchase. I think that his uh, logic made so much sense. And it was just, it was nice to have a conversation with him. He was so sweet. I hope he knows uh, that he just made, um, he made a gal's night being so kind to take the time, knowing that he wasn't going to get any of the sales, but to just stop and have really good just pleasant conversations, and I really appreciated every moment when he when he kind of stopped and, and would converse with me over things. So uh, a nice shout out to that lovely young gentleman. So there you have it. I hope you enjoyed this video. I know it went long. I thought that this part would be so short. I intended to add other things onto this video, but it looks, alas, that is not meant to be. Thank you so much for your time. I appreciate each and every one of you. Thank you for being a part of Vlogmas. Take care. Have a great day. Bye.